Good morning. So rising South African tennis star Zoe Kruger stormed back from a set down to beat Dutch fifth seed Suzanne Lemons 3-6, 6-4 and 6-4 and clinch her first ITF pro title at the Tux International on Sunday. The 19-year-old, who caused a major upset by beating France's top seed in the quarterfinals, made a slow start dropping the opening set but produced an instant response to end up clinching the title. Kruger joins us now via Zoom to chat about her impressive performance. A very good morning to you, Zoe. First of all, a huge well done. We're very proud of you. You must still be on cloud nine. How are you feeling and what does this mean for you? Thank you so much for having me. No, I'm ecstatic, honestly. I think it's such a privilege being able to, you know, get my first title at home. And um, actually the court that I had my first tennis lesson on, like <laughs> ever. So I think it's a major privilege and um, a huge advantage. And I'm very excited about the future. So Zoe, I'm quite curious, how does this win affect your ranking? Quite a lot, actually. Um, at the ranking spot that I'm at right now, it can jump up to like 200 spots. So I think, mm. you know, having to win this title got me a lot of points. So I'm very, very happy. It gives me opportunity to play into bigger tournaments as well. Yeah, that's very exciting, Zoe. I know that sports runs through your family, the love of sport. Your father himself was a great rugby legend. Talk to me about how you got into tennis, how you fell in love with the sport. Um, actually, about four years old, um, my uncle, who is still a tennis coach, took me on the court for the first time and um, just fell in love with it. Actually, I played every single sport that you can possibly imagine up until the age of 12 mm. um, before we moved overseas. And um, I think just the all-round love of sport like runs through the family. And I chose tennis because ultimately I felt like I could do um, the best at it. Yeah. Talk to me about the, your run through the tournament. How tough has it been for you to actually get to that win in the final and winning your first pro title? Talk to me about what the tournament was like and how tough it was. First of all, it was a major honor to have the tournaments at home. I think we haven't yeah. had that opportunity in quite a while, so I think it's so nice to play at home. Um, but, um, yeah, I think the tournament itself was quite tough. I played the number one seed in the quarterfinals, but I also played her last week and lost to her. So I had to come in with a completely different strategy and um, I didn't know any of the girls that I played or I knew like one or two, but the rest of the girls I didn't know at all. So I had to completely just play my own game and I think it was very tough. It was definitely a fight um, <laughs> more than anything. So yeah, I'm very, very happy to have won the title and have moving forward from here. Yeah, like I said, it's a huge achievement. Just, you know, you mentioned that you started playing tennis at around the age of four. Talk to me about some of the sacrifices that you have to make, you know, to get to where you are. It couldn't have been easy. I'm sure it requires a lot of hard work. Definitely. I think sacrifice is the number one thing. And, you know, just being able to train every single day and stand off time with your friends and doing normal things, I think that and also us a really big opportunity to, you know, gain points without having to travel internationally um, when we're still young. So I think that gives a major opportunity and also for the younger players to mm. develop, um, you know, play against the players coming from internationally and, you know, giving them the opportunity to play against them. I think that's exposure that you can't change for anything. Zoe, you are 19 years old, if I'm not mistaken. What message or word of advice would you give to any young, you know, young girl who wants to end up you know, in your shoes, wants to end up becoming a tennis player? I mean, the cliche thing to say is never give up. But seriously, I think just like keep on going and keep doing your thing. And like, I think progress, it's a process, I think. It's not a, it's not a race. It's really, really a process. It's... It doesn't just come overnight. It's not an overnight sensation. It's hard work every single day, day in, day out. So just keep on going every single day. Keep doing you and your, your time will come. Absolutely good advice. Thank you so much, Zoe. We wish you all the best. We know that you're going to carry on achieving more and more good things. All the best, Zoe. Thank you very much for your time. That was Zoe Kruger who's just won her first pro title.